So, uh, are there? <laughs> hello, everybody. Uh, a lot happened last session, namely the <laughs> fact that the stream barely worked. Uh, so we tried using cameras again. We keep trying because I like them. Um, but I don't know whether it was that my computer couldn't handle it, the bandwidth couldn't handle it, or something went wrong. If you look at my videos on Twitch, you will see a bunch of, like, 30-second to 2-minute clips that just kept getting chopped up and saved, and they're all choppy, and all sorts of things. So we cut the feed, and then decided to play out the rest of the session as normal. So in the end, what happened, to give you all a summary, they... the... The Barely Adventures decided to track down the errant nimble right going ward by ward. They found that he was basically just, or a nimble right, was basically just down the street uh, from their place of residence at a manor known as the Growlhund Villa. Um, they decided to do a little bit of investigating uh, whilst um, Kalana kept watch. And Kalana spotted a bunch of Zentarum hopping the fence. So when they came back from their slight investigation where they found out more about an artifact known as the Stone of Galore, and that it was supposed to be... It seemed like it was getting delivered to them. They then um, got caught up and decided to alert the city guard that the Zentarum were going into the Growlhound Villa in what seemed like a... Uh, kind of um, threatening manner. So they did, and the guard decided, hey, we're going to get a warrant to search the place. We'll keep post, keep watch. You go about your lives, citizens. So then they decided to break in. Um, well, I decided <laughs> to break in after I realized silence had been cast. Yes. Um, they, they, uh, tried to create some loud noises using thaumaturgy and to kind of get the guard to immediately take action. And they found out that silence had been cast within the manor. So they went to the, uh, coach house, broke in, and on their way into the villa itself were spotted by the groundskeeper and his two wolves who immediately melted into shadows as the sun set. They chased them into the house uh, as, the, as our party had pushed a bed up against the door to try to stop their progression, thinking, oh, they will have to bust down the door, not realizing that shadows can squeeze through one-inch spaces. The shadows <laughs> got into the room and began to fight the party, and sadly... Um, Mark had his strength drained uh, all the way down to zero, and he instantly died. Again. Yes. All of this happened within a silence bubble. Um, after a little bit of conversation, trying to figure out what they were going to do as a result, uh, Truth came over, summoned his greatsword, and squished Mark's head in. So that way, when the authorities did come into the, the manor, they would not have a recognizable associate corpse laying in the middle of the room. Yay. <laughs> and that's where we left off. <laughs> you sure did. <laughs> it's a great spot. Yes, it was. So, is silence still up? <sighs> um, Yes. <sighs> There is the area over here in the corner where you guys are not within any silence bubble. Um, but over here is still definitely silenced. Cool. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to drag the bed back into place. All right. And this is uh, good old Mark's corpse. Uh huh. <laughs> Which I. May do not he have rest in swoosh. I do not have an emote to uh, make him lay down. So. Uh -huh. I'm just gonna take that away. Oh, there are emotes. I'm yeah. saying. <laughs> that was a wiggle. That wasn't sad. <laughs> the emote system is underworks, being the alpha. Oh, okay. All of right. course. I'm gonna gingerly step back over the corpse. So. 
<laughs> All right, well, that's taken care of. So, uh, we can continue, or what are we doing here? <sighs> what you guys doing? Uh, well, Mark would have wanted us to see this through. We are already here. Mark would have wanted to live. <laughs> <laughs> Point taken. <laughs> Mark's not one a lot these days. Uh, you know what? I'm fucking. I'm going to. I'm going to keep going. Yeah, let's just. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm feeling a little reckless. My drinking buddy just died, so let's fucking do this. Why not? All right. So you guys have an entrance to the uh, north here, a door here to somewhere else in the house. And Open then the you also door. had another door outside. I'm voting with the door inside the house. Can, can I check these trunks? Sure. I'm just going to, like, look through the, I guess, the the first one that's inside the Zone of Silence, if it's still up. It is full of a handful of clothing and um, what seems to be some leather armor. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> I'll walk back over. Uh, guard stuff. All right. <laughs> really? You don't unless, say. Unless anybody wants some leather armor. I don't know, I think we're... Um... I could replace the one from the shit stewers. Oh, yeah. But we should get moving. Mm -hmm. I want to sneak up to the door and... and stealthily peer out the one that goes to the inside of the house which which door the one uh, that continues on the inside the only one that doesn't go outside this one yeah yes that one okay oh yeah you hadn't moved your character so i wasn't sure no that's I, i'm trying to sure. figure it back out <laughs> um yeah. once you have clicked your character you can you should be able to shift an arrow keys to move that can usually help <laughs> having having fun there, now? Uh huh. I'm there. I'm there. We're good. <laughs> okay. Um. So go ahead and make me a stealth check if you want to try to open it quietly. Well, is it in the cone of silence? Yes, it is. <laughs> so I'm not exactly worried about the noise so much as someone seeing me so Walk up, slowly open. open the door does it take you? no <laughs> a... and you say that was a perception or a stealth? stealth 20 20 yes uh, you're able to very easily ease open the door um, what's in there you can see uh some handful from where you're standing you can see a handful of bits of armor and what appears to be the feet of someone on the floor one laying down on the floor yep. did, uh, did i hear that noise that was just made or is yes. that in the code of silence okay Go investigate. Oh. So you enter the room, Truth and Kalana. Uh huh. Um, and I assume it looks like Corbin's coming in too. Mm -hmm. um, you see a half elf man bound and gagged on the floor. Um, he appears to be in some very scantily clad leathers. Let me there. there are <laughs> a few whips lying on the ground um. and a small pile of neatly folded uh, what appear to be very vibrant clothing and other vestments and a loot in the corner. Oh, no. Is he was he gagged? Yes. Oh, OK. 
Oh. You, I'll, you I'll, can I'll hear cut. him. Yeah, I'll, I'll cut him. Cut the ties. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very different things. <laughs> Not a monster, but... Uh, <laughs> I'm uncomfortable. <laughs> I wasn't... You said leathers and things, and I was like, oh, oh what did we just walk in on? <laughs> <laughs> Whips. <laughs> there. Yeah, that was the one that made me think, uh, hmm. Yeah. I'm just gonna reclose cut, that door. Cut, 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 cut him free. Huh. <laughs> hmm. <clears throat> oh, thank you. Hey, buddy. <sighs> You're welcome. Um. Who are you who guys? Are you? Uh, Here. first. Well, who are you? You're rescuers. Maybe. No, I don't. I don't like that. Maybe. I was just. Uh, Basic question. Oh, what, what are you doing here? Hmm. Uh, in such a interesting uh, situation. Uh, working. Um. <coughs> In what capacity? <laughs> Allow me to introduce myself. I am Martin Lovesong. I'm oh. an entertainer. I'm sorry. That's a way to put it. <laughs> Do the three of you work for the Groundhogs? We are here to help them because there's been... Of a breaking break and entering. We're the cavalry. Yes. Are you the ones breaking and entering? No. <laughs> Fair question. Uh, no. Uh, uh, well, Shh. I mean, <laughs> yes, good but actually, no. They broke in first. Yeah. yeah, we're Breaking here to in. help stop the other people breaking in. The so, sound guard refused yes. to help, so we're trying to help. Yes. Some bureaucratic nonsense, I don't know. There's a warrant or something, I don't know. They were just too lazy to get in here and deal with it. Damn bureaucrats. Alright, well, um... Can you fight? Uh, that's an odd question and extremely worrying given the circumstances, but actually, yes. It's going to be a lot more worrying when you go into the next room. <laughs> yeah, that was, yeah. <laughs> what size armor do you wear? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we could just look at this. <laughs> I point to my pile of clothing. That yeah. size. You know what? Go ahead and get the <laughs> which... tired of looking Yeah, at clothes are good. <laughs> Clothes are good. <laughs> there you go. Belly button. Go ahead. And yeah. Here. Speaking oh, of those... which, unless you guys are gonna pay, I'm gonna need to get dressed. Yeah. So. Oh, those are those right. are assless. Oh, I did not realize. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I get dressed. <laughs> assless. What does your What does your regular clothing look like, good sir? And describe <laughs> Describe your character for for for, for us. Ah, uh, crap, I hadn't thought of that. <laughs> uh, um, <laughs> stand by. Do, 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 do. Didn't think beyond naked. <laughs> he looks like a relative of Mark. <laughs> Whoa, hold up. I see some resemblance here. <laughs> Is this like from Beer Fest where his brother that looks exactly like him comes into the room? It's the same actor. <laughs> <laughs> no. How did whoa. Mm -hmm. So because I did not think of a description, I'm just gonna use the model that we have available and oh. assume my character has long blonde hair and is wearing a pink uh is that pink? I mean, it can be, can't it? It's salmon. <laughs> okay, he's wearing a salmon guards outfit. 
Just, you know, all <laughs> kinds of flamboyant. Oh, flamboyant Fabio, got it. <laughs> Very nice. Well, it's better than before. <laughs> right. So, um, I have to ask, were you in the position that we found you in willingly, or did you encounter the ones who are breaking in? Well, I went into it willingly like 12 hours ago. Not so much when you found me a few minutes ago. Okay, fair enough. Mm. So, would you like to be led out of here, or do you want to join us with our investigation? Yeah, we're trying to figure out what's going on here. Well, my schedule's clear for the rest of the evening, so let's go. Yes. Watch your step in the next room. Why do you guys keep saying stuff that's so concerning? You'll, <laughs> you'll figure it out. You'll, you'll see. Uh, well, this is a very, uh, this is a quite concerning uh, situation. So uh, that makes sense. Oop. Doors, how do they work? God. Okay. You know what? We're just gonna shift. There we go. It's so much easier than dragging when it comes to doorways. Yep. So, uh, Martin, you come in. Oh the God! Why did I walk it? And see, <laughs> and see a corpse lying on the ground with its head squished in. Um, you also realize that you cannot make any actual noise. You open your mouth and no sound comes out. That's probably for the best. Yeah. He, he went to scream but found out he could not. <laughs> mm. okay. All right, so we're just gonna go at the. Oh, you all, you all guys win the. So the silence. You can't you can't hear a word I'm saying right now. All right, that, no, that's fine. I'm just gonna stay over here. What if they can hear you? Oh, they can't. I thought yes. sound couldn't transmit through. I'm just inside. nod my head. I think sound cannot be made <laughs> inside of a bank. Okay. Yeah, that's a uh, that's what. Uh, don't worry about that. Uh... <laughs> I think oh, no. that's my Creature. cousin. Sorry, we're, we're, creatures we're that are deafened about inside it. of it, so yes. Wait, what'd you say? Creatures are deafened inside of it, so you're right. Oh, okay. So, uh, what, what'd you say about the, the corpse there? What's, uh... Is that Mark Smithson? Jesus Christ, you can still recognize him? He's oh, my please. cousin. What happened to him? Well, <laughs> I'm not go anymore. <laughs> he brings up a good point. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. He did recognize him. <laughs> All right, fuck it. I go back over. I, I gotta I gotta take care of this. I walk oh, over. I start just mutilating the corpse. I'm not looking. Do ba do ba do. Turns out it was just like the imprint on his boot. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Well, right, that can you recognize him now? <laughs> Martin has opened the door to the outside. Oh yeah, okay, okay that's well fine. then. Okay, <laughs> I guess you just Leroy Jenkins uh, in it here. All right, I guess we'll see what's out here. Uh, we are now visible through the gate. Oh fuck! Hold up, no, I, no, no, I'm not doing that. <laughs> through the gate. Oh, is that the front gate over there? That's yes, the front it is. Gate. Hey, Get the fuck back inside. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to figure out where he. God damn it! Okay, you know what? This is what happens when you don't let the stinky person open the doors. Thank you. There we go. <laughs> Going through doorways is so hard with dragging. <laughs> Get your ass back inside. <laughs> Martin, wait, don't... Uh, oh, okay, alright. The DM has rolled. It's too late for oh, him no! now. Uh, uh, Mark, are you meaning to speak or are you being quiet on purpose? Uh, no, I was just waiting to see what happened once I, you know, walked. Okay. 
Nothing seems to happen. Um, I just, yeah. since you hadn't said anything, I wasn't sure if you uh, weren't sure about, like, your push to talk or whatever. Mm. Um, Get back inside! You, you, you know, you see the very fine Grauhund estate. It is night. Um, the moon is low in the sky. Um, and you can see the vague shape of a guard outside the front gate. All right, well, I'm going to turn back to Kalana and whisper, I'm not coming back inside. You people are insane. Why are we whispering? Because that guard will kill you if he sees you. Well, actually, no, wait, this could be good. Listen. What? No. We could, have, we, we could, we could sneak out. And then he he's supposed to be here anyway, so he can go alert the guard and be like, hey. know that? "Well, it fucking he's not in a a, a robe and daggers." <laughs> I mean, I guess he probably looks like he belongs more than we do. Exactly. Oh god. I mean, if anything, people saw him come in. Uh, I, I guess yesterday. <laughs> Yeah, he doesn't exactly so, seem discreet, so So we could we could get the guard to to actually come in and do some shit if he if he alerts them. And meanwhile we, we can sneak out the back and, and what, what, could, what happening to to finding out what was happening? I'm just, well, this changes things. There's 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 new there's new avenues for attack. Or retreat in this case. Why would I help you? You murdered my cousin. You people are crazy. We didn't murder him. <laughs> uh, okay, despite what you saw there, uh, we did not kill him. He was with the us. shadows. Killed him. Um, Martin, <laughs> as a frequentor of the Grauhun's estate, uh, you do know that they actually employ shadows as their guards. Processing. How? What? What do you mean? How? They drained all of his strength. He. That's why he looks so shriveled up. He has no, no muscle. Out of character. How? Oh. How do oh, you, sorry. How do you hire shadows? <laughs> you don't know how. Magic? I don't. There are ways. <laughs> but the point is that, as Martin, you have seen them patrolling before. You don't necessarily know that they're hired or bound or what. But you do know that they have them. All right, uh, back in character. That actually makes a little more sense. Okay, fine. All right. Uh, so, do you wanna you wanna alert the guard, or do we wanna continue through and and? See if you're uh, your client. I don't know. You were bound and gagged in a closet. Is that a normal? Is that a normal thing that happens here, or are they? Uh... I think it was normal, unfortunately. Oh, uh, what? Not to be rude, but I was paid a lot of money to specifically not answer that question. All right, fair enough. That's fine. Uh, <laughs> so I'd say that these are lucrative clients. Yes. Yes. All right. So uh, they have a manor in their own guard. I yeah, mean, I, yeah. Just do you want to do you want to help them or uh, you, you should get them? revenge for your cousin and let's go find out what's going on. Well, that was that's kind of on us, I think. But <laughs> 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 uh, 
No, I'm, I'm not laughing in character. <laughs> oh, that would be that would be maniacal. All right. Uh, uh, so you wanna you wanna help out your your client, or you wanna you wanna come with us to see what happened, or you wanna let the guard know something's going on here? It's up to you. Every fiber of my being is saying this is a terrible, poorly thought out plan. Uh huh. Yep. Mm -hmm. But I'm really confused about this uh, silence zone. So let's. Go. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I mean, yes. Let's go. All right, we're we're going to investigate. Let's. I guess let's do this. All right. I think there is a guard out front in front of the gate. I think that's where we left him. So maybe. Oh yeah, we're gonna let's yeah let's go to the back. Let's go to the back of the room. That's a great idea. <laughs> As you once again <laughs> enter the zone of silence. That's a grat. <laughs> yeah, I think we should definitely follow. Uh, quietly open the door again, or well, slowly open the door. I don't have to quiet anything. Yeah, um, make me a stealth check. Oh, it's not the zone of silence, huh? No, it is. She's, she's doing it. She's trying to make sure she's slow and not be seen. Oh. Nine. Okay. I mean, you Nine. open the door. Okay. You don't know if it was particularly. Do I stealthy. see anyone out here? If I you, step out, you do not. Hmm. Okay, good. To the next door. We're in for it now, guys. <laughs> if I jiggle the handle on this one, is it still silent too? Yes, it is also okay. unlocked. Oh, yay! All right. Same thing. Okay, roll me a stealth check. Uh, it's not coming up, but that is a 15, it looks like. So 20. Nice. Inside you see a uh, warm hearth slowly dying down. And a bunch of cookware and utensils and laid out food. Hmm. You seem to have come into a kitchen. Clearly later at night and the food's not gone yet. Oops, sorry. So, is it clear? Anybody in here nope. that I see? Oh, this is a much smaller room than I thought it would be. Uh, go into the right side if you're trying to come in. There you go. Yeah, you are still not making any noises. And there's two doors. Take a, take a little piece of food off the table. I was going to say, if anyone has... Yeah, I'm yeah. definitely taking some food. <laughs> um, maybe a nice cheese or something. That'd be good. It is delicious. <laughs> very, very, fi some for later. very finely cooked food. Uh, much better than what you serve at your own tavern. Of course it is. <laughs> we cook it. Yeah. Who would eat there? All right, I'm going to kind of point between the two doors and, like, shrug my shoulders, like, which one do we want to go? So, do I know the layout of the main building? Um, you know that this is kind of more the servants' areas. Uh, you know that the Growlhoon's uh, master suites, and you're, you're fairly close to the dining hall. And you know that the Growlhound's master suites are kind of that way and upstairs. You, you're not intricately familiar with a lot of the place, um, but you know the general layout. Hmm. 
Yeah, where, where should we go from here? Uh, what was your name again? You are still silenced. Yep. God, God dang it. <laughs> Zone of Silence McGee is my... <laughs> I, I guess I come over to the door that you're next to. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna uh, try to open this door. Okay. Roll me a stealth check if you want to try to open it slowly and cautiously. Jesus. 24. You're gonna roll right. like threes in combat. I know. <laughs> I'm wasting all my good rolls now. Let I'm gonna let you go through first. Make a small edit. <laughs> Again, this is Jonas Highlands. God damn. Yeah. Um, yeah, so you just kind of have to motion. Um, so this seems to be a pantry lined with shelves containing dry foodstuffs, spices, tablecloths, jars of preserves, um, ale, wine. Uh, the back door seems to be barred. Uh, it has a bunch of oh. different crates and stuff kind of shoved up against it. This is the door we tried to come in, I'm sure. There are also two corpses on the ground. Oh. There oh. we go. <laughs> <laughs> like that would have stood out more. Yeah. <laughs> no, well, we're I, all I, I want to do bitches. something here. The food that stands out first. Uh, I want to do. I want to do something yeah. here. Hold on. I'm rolling. I'm rolling a perception. <laughs> oh boy. Oh okay. All right. I, I, I see that there's bodies. <laughs> yes. Um, <laughs> there seems to be an older male human. Uh, Martin, you know this to be the head butler. And a younger male halfling. Which you know to be the cook. I will sadly look at their corpses, but maybe take some of the spices off the shelves. Because <laughs> could you use those? Are we still silenced? Yes. Hmm. Fuck. <laughs> Is there a window or anything on this next door that I'm at? No. I uh, I, I motion with my hands like a, a wait gesture. I'll not. Right here. And I just I walk back. <laughs> I walk all the way back over here. I'm walking all the way back to the. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'm walking all the way back over here. Uh, God damn it! You gotta open what the door. The fuck? Oh, I'm sorry. The door is all right there. Realize the door was closed. I'm walking all the way back over here to where I'm not silenced anymore. Okay. Sweet and I Jesus. cast Mage Armor. <laughs> and then I walk all the way back. That's smart. I realize I didn't have it on yet. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, I, I make a. I come back in the room, and make a continue motion. <laughs> Should I close the door? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'll go. I'll go ahead. No, I'll go ahead and yeah. close these doors. Where's Martin? The outside doors. As I come through. As I come in. Oh. Oh, we can't miss Martin. He's very oh, there colorful. He there we go. Okay. I was only counting three, but we're good. All right, I, I make continue motion. All right, next door. There it is. Nice. Seven. It's too All late right. to say I assist. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah. All righty then. Uh, so you open the door. You feel it maybe a little quick. <laughs> um, and you can see what appears to be a dining table and some chairs laid out. As you enter the room, uh, you can see a cross. Uh, go ahead and uh, everybody stop moving for a minute. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, oh, I see. <laughs> you can see across the room. No, no worries, just me. And you see that the floor in the dining hall is strewn with bodies. Neat. Two thugs hold bloody maces, stand over them. As soon as you open the door, they look up at you 
and kind of ready their maces for combat. Roll initiatives. <laughs> we the one door we don't open quietly. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, better than I thought it would be. Huh. Ready then. You. Oh. Okay. Um. Uh, da -da -da, where's my initiative tracker? Combat mode. That's what it is. All right. Um. Twenty-five to twenty. Twenty. Uh, 20 to 15. 15 to 10. 11. 10 to 5. Six. Nine. Uh, 15 to 20. 15 to 20. Alright. So the first person to go is this first thug Oh, here. wow. Got above a 20, damn. Alright. <laughs> And then he's going to kind of stand there defensively. Corbin. Mm. Let's see. Well, I mean, clearly this dude's coming at me here, so just going to go up and meet him, I guess. Attacks and... you make are at a... Uh, wait, is defensive disadvantage or... Does it oh, just give him extra AC? Yeah, I can't remember if it's extra AC or disadvantage. I don't... It's not a rule that's used that often. Oh. Um, because most people most people don't take the defensive action. Um, <laughs> oh. Yeah, because most people kind of forget they can. Um, yeah, I've never even heard of it. Huh. Let me look up on D and D Beyond over here. Actions in combat. Um, dodge the dodge, dodge action. Uh, yep, so you have disadvantage against him. Hmm. Is that on attack rolls or just all actions? Attack rolls. Hmm. I debated on just trying to talk to the dude as I came up to him, but I don't know. <laughs> it is... Clearly. You are still not Clearly. making any noise. That's fair. Alright, well, I have nothing left to do, I guess. I can't sneak attack him because no one else is over here. I may have done the wrong decision here. Alright, so... <laughs> I mean, I guess I'll just swing and see what we get. Whoop. So, looks like we got a... Oh, Aww. okay. So, a seven. <laughs> 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 so, that's uh, plus four, so eleven. That's a hit. Oh, damn. Okay. So, then, no sneak attack, but we do get one of these guys. Oh, uh, six. All right. And then the second attack. Uh, ten. That's a miss. Uh, okay. It just glances against his armor. And then, let's see. So I went from one, two, three, four squares. So I'll move one more to there, probably. All right. Okay. And that's it. Kalana. Would I be able to make a half move up onto the table and yes. attack? Awesome. Yes, you can. And if you can't, I will move you up there. Okay, cool. Got it. Uh, I'm going to fire at the one attacking Corbin. Uh, I do have these guys labeled, so if you hold tab, their names should show up. Thug one and thug two? Yep. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I, I was like, do they have names? <laughs> thug one. Then. Oof. Big oof. Ten? <laughs> nope. Yeah, I didn't think so. Does defensive stance only work on melee attacks? Uh, no, you, you st are also still imposed at disadvantage. So, I mean, not that you could have rolled much worse than that anyway. She could have shot me with a one. <laughs> <laughs> yep, it could have been worse. <laughs> 
Uh, that's the, that's, that's what it. I got. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Thug two. And this is where. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just kick that die out of the way. Right, she moves there. Missed that one line? And he is also going to take the dodge action. Hmm. Did they get rid of the feature that allows me to delete my oh, own dice? Uh, they shouldn't have. I can I'm clear right all them. I can clear all. Uh, that's dice. fine. I just realized I've thrown like six uh, dice. Actually, this guy is not going to um, going to take the dodge action. Instead, he will pull out his heavy crossbow and shoot <laughs> <Rude>. at Kalano. <laughs> so I hmm. that is a thirteen to hit. So that will miss. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> I was going to say, I can't see where they are in the other room, and there's silence, so they don't know we're fighting right now. <laughs> no, they true. don't! <laughs> well, they can probably well, see me climb up on the table and fire an arrow. Well, yeah, I'm doorway, hoping, like, so... depending on where they are in the doorway, yeah. <laughs> Truth. Uh, since I'm still in the zone of silence, I don't hear any of this. Yep. <laughs> Do I see any of this? Uh, roll me a perception check. Wee. That's going to Yep, that's... that's, that's Glad fine. it pops up on the screen. Uh, five. <laughs> five. Uh, no. <laughs> you know that they, they, they rushed inside, and that's all you know. All right, I'm going to walk over here. I'm going to start moving these boxes out from in front of the door. <laughs> okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, I have no idea what's going on. That's uh, fair. It'll take you three turns to do so. Oh my god. <laughs> 15 seconds is pretty good for clearing out a doorway. Okay. <laughs> Martin. Oh god, damn. <laughs> oh god, for fuck. It was what I was going to do before you opened the door. Yeah. Assess the situation. <laughs> yeah, Martin, you can see what's going on. <laughs> All right, so yes, I walk in, I assess the situation, and then I pull out my crossbow and shoot at the guy who is also holding a crossbow. God. Thirteen. That's a hit. Your bolt sinks into the... Oh, wait, uh, was that at this event? Oh, wait, no. God, shooting crossbow isn't dodging. I'm dumb. Continue. It hit. Brain. Brain not work. Seven damage. All right. Thug one will now go ahead and swing at Corbin with his mace. That is a... Um, Didn't show up on mine. 21 to hit. I'm rolling uh, DM dice. So that's right. And yes, that definitely hits. All right. Just realized my rogue has less AC than my warlock does in my other campaign. Nice. <laughs> um, that is Jesus. five bludgeoning damage. <laughs> Mega oof. Oh, I already had to. Ooh, okay. Oh, yeah, you guys didn't take a short rest. What the hell? And then he's going to swing at you again. <laughs> there we go. My math was weird. For 21 to hit. Yeah. For 6 bludgeoning damage. Down. Oh. It's a minus 1. So you are dying. <laughs> yep. So, funny thing, if you put in minus 5 on D&D &D Beyond and then hit damage, it adds 5 to your health. Because it did a double negative. <laughs> so, Interesting. I was like, what the hell? <laughs> All right, uh, Corbin, making me a death saving throw. <laughs> hey, good way to start. These have disadvantage too. I'm just kidding. No. Anyway, <laughs> that is one failure. What? You just yeeted that through the wall, didn't you? <laughs> Much like my life. <laughs> Kalana. Oh god, <laughs> hold on. This fucking bill is just gonna be the death of card. Oh god! <laughs> just watch a very silent 
Uh, Smack to the face. Twice. <laughs> a sickening... Cr well, hey, what you imagine would have been a sickening crunch. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Trying to figure out what I can do if I can save him with my charm of restoration. <laughs> so he doesn't uh, die. I don't believe so. I don't think so either. Because I think that's cast greater restoration. Is that right? Mm -hmm. That's a really good yeah. spell to just be able to cast once. Uh, greater restoration. It is a... Because it's a charm charges. Yeah, it is a melee don't... spell. It's touch. Um, you Ooh, can okay. cure an effect that has charmed or petrified the target. You can clear mm. one curse. Uh, you can get rid of a reduction to one of the target's ability scores. Woo! Ha! <laughs> <laughs> um, or one effect reducing the target's hit point maximum. So, no. Nope. Nope. All right. Well, I well, tried. Sorry. That, that, uh, that could have saved Mark. <laughs> shit. I asked, and you said no. <laughs> well, because you asked after he was dead. He literally oh, has okay, true. All right. Sorry. relatives. <laughs> well, now we got a stripper, so it's fine. <laughs> totally fine. All right, I'll take another shot at Thug. Uh, I'll take a shot at Thug Two. Okay. That'll hit. Uh, yeah, I was like plus seven. I'm trying to do the math, but yeah. Uh, seven damage. Alright. Uh, he's looking hurt. Um, Thug 2 will just shoot back. For a 16 to hit. That'll hit. Alright. Uh. Whoop. Oh well. Five damage. Okay. Truth. You're still uh, moving boxes, I assume. Do I know? Do I notice anything? I mean, make me a perception check. Yeah. Did he feel a thud from my corpse hitting the floor? Oh, hey! You Not a corpse yet! You definitely see that both Kalana and Martin have been firing projectiles. Oh! I run in. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> oh, man. That's good, because the next and, projectile was about to be at him. <laughs> and now you see that Corbin is on the ground. Oh, fuck! Uh, 25, 30, that's all, that's all the far I can get without a dash. And uh, am I? Is it still silenced? Yes. All right. Well, yep. That's uh, that's all I can do then. <laughs> I mean, I can, I can run over. Uh, I dash. So I can get over beside him with a dash, but I can't do anything else. Um. Oh yeah, Eldritch Blast does have a verbal component. It does. <laughs> I have to use my weapon. So. <laughs> Yeah. Who knew yeah, that I mean, a simple zone of silence I, would kill so many people? I summoned my greatsword again, <laughs> but I okay. can't use it. <laughs> All right. Martin. All right. I guess I'm going to move over here to get a little bit closer. And then I'm going to shoot at Table Thug. Okay. Thug 2. Nineteen. That'll hit. I think. I might actually yeah, survive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, only for us all to go to jail when the guards break in here. <laughs> <laughs> At least we won't be dead. Six. All right. Let's just hope that warrant doesn't come through early. Thug one is going to. Uh... Yeah, I mean, he's just going to be... He can reach um, Truth, so... He's just going to attack you, Truth. With his Yay. mace. 
Yeah. That is a 16 to hit. Uh, 16 hits. <laughs> that is 8 bludgeoning damage. Oof. And then he swings again with a natural 20. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no, please, no. <laughs> Uriah? Yeah? You did not tell us we were playing two of Annihilation. <laughs> That is 12 bludgeoning damage. God! <laughs> right, I'm down. Oh, is, that, is that insta death or is that just down? No, I'm just down. Okay. <laughs> Fucking shit. It's just you and the stripper. Corbin roll. God damn it. Roll. Jesus. Oh, wait. And then, sorry. Then the thug is actually going to move. Because um, he just downed. Nope, not that thug. Click this thug. Click him through the chair. Come on. He's just... He's gonna hop over the chair, but he's gonna wind up there. Nimble bastard. Yeah. Right. All right. Corbin, roll your death safe. Woo! Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> it was right there. One more failure. I saw a 20. I At least it's 20. not a one. Yeah, that would have been death right away, right? Yep. Oh, God. Uh. Kalana... <laughs> Damn. Taking this one out on the table. <laughs> you know what? No, no, I'm taking out the one with the mace. He seems to be the problem. I'm gonna shoot at Thug One. Uh, eighteen. Or sorry, nineteen. That's a hit. Roll for damage. Into Six. the baluster. Bannister. Alright. Thug two. Gonna shoot a clown. Uh ten to hit. No. Alright. Truth. Roll the death saving throw. Uh oh. One success. Okay. Yee. <laughs> Martin. What kind of action would it be to um, feed, force feed truth one of my uh, healing potions? An action. An action? Yes. Healing potions, man. Someone's doing well. <laughs> I feel like Cora do... might need it more, but <laughs> we have um, He doesn't know that though. That's um, true. Do we? I do have one. What? I have two. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, oh well. Well, looks like you guys are gonna get some nice equipment. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, give Truth the potion. Okay. Roll for the dice. Uh, regular is 1d4? D4? 2d4 plus 2. Yeah, that's right. 2d4 plus 2. So, 9. Sweet. Truth. You said truth, I assume? Yeah, because I can't reach the corpus. Yep, you are at 9 HP and wide awake. Whoa. Wait. And now it's the one turn. <laughs> what, uh, are back. you going to move first? <laughs> That's a better question. Me? Yes. No. Okay. No. All right. Well, he is going to attack you, Martin. For a uh, eight hit. Miss. And a... 20 to hit. <laughs> that one hits. You take 6 bludgeoning damage. Corbin. Death saving throw. Uh, Please don't die. Please don't die. If I roll like 27 dice, you won't know. <laughs> hey! Six, one success! Yay! We're gonna go this route. Alright gonna get 2-2 two, two and then fail. Alright. <laughs> Kalana. 
All right, I'm going to try to finish off uh, Thug 2 on the table here. Okay. You guys are just having a shootout across the giant dining table. <laughs> Apparently uh, they're 16. both because there's no That's obstacles. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. And oh. 10. Woof. All right, with that, your arrow catches him square in the eye. And he falls yeah. over. Dead. Okay, I was going to ask, does he die from that? <laughs> Better fucking die. <laughs> That's the goal. <laughs> All right. Get him that exact part of the brain that doesn't cause death. <laughs> Truth. <laughs> Buh, uh... Is there a thought? Wait, did we kill both of them? Nope. Where's the other guy? No. I don't see. Hotab. Hotab. Diagonal oh, from he's you. Like, right. He's the shadow. Is um, there a shadow for you? Can I, like, kick the chair next to him into him? You can certainly try. I'm going to try to do that. All right. Um, Make me an athletics check. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done this. <laughs> Come on, no whammy. Uh, six. <laughs> okay, well, he gets to make a dex save. Oh, good. You might have been easier just picking up the chair and smashing him with it. <laughs> uh, what is his... Oh, wow. Um, Alright, so you manage to knock him prone as he gets hit by the chair. Ha-ha! Oh my God. <laughs> is that an action? Yes. Okay. Alright, well, that was my action. Um... I don't have any healing potions, I don't believe. They're actions to use anyway. Okay, yep, all right, never mind, I'm done. <sighs> Martin. All right, well, I guess... He is prone in front of you. I'm going to pull out my rapier and stab him. And you... since I have free hand, I'm going to flip him off with the other one. You get advantage. Dope. You gotta you get an advantage on giving him a bird. Twenty. That's a hit. I don't remember how much damage rapiers do. One moment. Should be on your sheet. Uh, oh, sweet D eight. I'm thinking six, but seven stabby damage. All right, he's looking pretty rough. All right, he is. He will then go and attack Martin. That is a uh, six to hit, or sorry, eight. Nah. And a ten to hit. Nah. All right. Corbin, make a death save. Ask not for whom the die rolls. <laughs> it rolls for thee. <laughs> no! No! Are there any bonuses that go to these? No. Nope. None. Okay. Oh, All right. Corbin damn. is dead. Oh. <laughs> we tried. I'm sorry, <laughs> Corbin. That's fair. The universe realized I've already made two characters this week. Why not a third? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you realize that means the only original party member now is Kalana. <laughs> Yep. Shit, now I can't I, die. I name her the sole inheritor of my money. <laughs> <laughs> I Which no really... one hears as you die in the cone of silence. <laughs> Cor Corbin just feels glad that he was able to die amongst the finer things in life. <laughs> <laughs> Being ex-noble himself. <laughs> Kalana. Alright, I'm, I'm, I'm... You know what? We're gonna go across... We're gonna go across the table here. And I'm going to whip out my spear, and I want to shish kebab this motherfucker. All right. You get advantage since he is prone. Oh, wait. No, he got up. Never mind. I'm dumb. Flat roll. Oh, that is a bum, miss. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> All right. Truth. Yo. <laughs> 
Uh, I'm going to uh, swing at him with my great sword. Is he still down? Or no? Yeah, uh, no, he's up. Yeah, he's up. Okay. Well, uh, stone's in the town, so yeah, I'm gonna swing him with my great sword. Cool. <laughs> and you're gonna miss. Thanks. Oof. The fuck is wrong with us? <laughs> <laughs> You're distracted by the fact that your friend is now an ex-adventurer. Yeah. <laughs> he has ceased to be. Martin. All right, let's see if the plus one train, or the uh, nat one train keeps on a rolling. I'm going to stab him, stab him. No, that's oh, a little better, 20. That's a hit. Alright, five down. Alright. He's still up. Well, I flip him the bird with my other hand. <laughs> <laughs> to which actually, he wait a... Go ahead. One second. Uh, what do I actually need to do for two weapon fighting? Because I've never done it before. Because I have a dagger. So you wield it in your other hand. It gets you lets you use a bonus action to attack with it, but you do not get a stat bonus on the damage roll. But I still get my proficiency bonus to the attack? Yes. Oh, can I go ahead and do that? Sure. Twenty. That's a hit. Is his main hand a small weapon? Oh wait, you know what? I thought it only required your offhand to be. And that might be. I, I I thought it was both, but I could be wrong. Um, I don't recall. I can look it up if you want, but I am looking it up right now. Okay. Yeah, I was say, would you guys? Because it, it doesn't yeah. really describe it on my sheet. It just says two weapon fighting. Yeah. Um. Should be under making an attack. Light weapon. Sorry, not small weapon. Nah, we do two try. weapon fighting. Um. When you take the attack action with a light melee weapon that you're holding in one hand, you can bonus you use a bonus action to attack with a different light melee weapon that you're holding in the other hand. So All right, well, the rapier is not light, so never mind. I did not do that second attack. Okay. My bad. <laughs> hey, good call out. Yeah, I forgot that rule. That had to be light. Yeah. So the thug is going to attack Martin. Uh, so that's that my a six to hit. That misses, and my offhand continues to flip him the bird. And a... Five to hit. Ah, uh, sorry, seven. Still. Still a miss. Yeah. Uh, Kalana. Alright, since I... Every time I try to do it in my spear, I just... I miss, so... We'll just longbow... Point blank range. <laughs> Uh, you get disadvantage on that. Uh, okay, fine. I'll back up one. Okay, he will take an opportunity attack against you. And he'll mess. <laughs> Yay! Hold on, I already have a dice in my hand, but I'll back up my character in yeah. a second. <laughs> um, 19. That's a hit. Ten. And you sink this straight into the back base of his skull. And he dies. Did she just and flip him off? <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> we need to... Oh. He never heard it coming. As, <laughs> as he dies, the uh, zone of silence wears off. You can hear the crackle coming from the fire in front of you. Holy fuck. Well, that was two out of six. Um, <laughs> does anyone want to keep taking our chances, or should we just go while we can? Uh, you now notice that Corbin is still on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Corbin. Oh, that's probably Corbin. not good. Yeah, all right. <laughs> still got that mace. C Corbin. Good. <laughs> Buddy. 
Oh, I'm, I'm gonna go over to him. Is he dead? Yes. Yeah, yeah, he, he is dead. showing no signs of life. Oh, I'm taking that that special crest from him before anybody sees it. Oh, that was it. that was quick. <laughs> <laughs> and then the ravens descend. Are you being <laughs> sneaky about it? Yeah. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Okay. I was just like just Cause checking I'm... him over and just like because I know I've seen it, so I'm the only one who has. I just want to make sure that he doesn't. Make that me. Nobody finds it on him. Make me a uh, stealth check. Let me see what. As I thought. Fourteen. All right. Uh, if you guys are paying attention to her, you roll me perception checks. Seven. <laughs> oh. Shit. Wait. Eleven. All right. Neither of you see her do anything. Yes. <laughs> you, you see, you're just looking over the body, just checking for signs of life. Um. Hey, Uriah. Yeah. Would that medallion have my standing on the back of it? No. No. Okay. Just your name. Okay. And also, you know, take his money and stuff once. <laughs> there it is. All right. I can tell you what's all in there. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. How much? off your what, inventory. What, what, what do they get? What do we get? So okay. So. I'll start with the thing everyone cares about, the money. So, for the money, you have 184 gold, 87 silver, and 250 copper. I probably could have converted that all into gold, but whatever. Um, I'll do that for you later. As far as <laughs> items go, uh, there's the standard adventurer's kit. There's also thieves' tools. Uh, and two healing potions. Potion of healing. Oh, could have used those. Yeah, two daggers and a set of leather armor. Otherwise, it's all standard stuff from Adventuring Kit. I'm definitely taking a Steve's tools. <laughs> there might also be... Hey, hey oh, Kalana, you oh. want to take one of the healing potions and I'll take the other? Yeah, sure. That sounds oh. good. Kalana, if, uh, I imagine you'd probably recognize... I don't know if the symbols are the same. I'd have to ask Uriah. I have a code mm-hmm. book as well from my faction. Ooh, okay. I don't know I'll definitely take what your eye wants to do with that. If okay. I can. Are you I assumed it would have the same crest, it? but yeah. <laughs> yes, I would like to sneakily take it. Okay, roll me a uh, stealth check then. Or, wait, is sleight of hand a thing in 5e? I always forget. Oh, yes. yes, sleight of hand. Uh, then sli- sleight of yes. hand, that. 24. I don't <laughs> think you guys are going to roll high enough on perception. But go I don't ahead. think they are. <laughs> I mean, a nat 20 may exist. <laughs> oh. <laughs> almost. <Not> today. <laughs> I think that was almost a 20. It looks 16. like it. Oh, okay. Alright. What you guys doing? Well, that sucks. Uh, <laughs> these zone of silence is Jeez. gone. I can cast spells now. <laughs> Not that it helps for... Uh, Oh, is it gone? I yes. missed that. Oh, yes. as That's the as the one died. Oh, uh, yep. Huh. Maybe I can be of use now. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> you got a restore spell. <laughs> oh, l- l- listen. Oh, you're uh, a walk. Never mind. Do, do we want to? Uh, want to? Uh, Leave the same there, thing. There, I, there yeah. is a pile of corpses like over here. Yeah, let's investigate that. Okay. It seems to be servants and various staff. Oh. Um, there are also eight people wearing what seems to be wearing chain shirts. Um, oh, yes. Yeah, sorry, actually, the scratch the servant thing. There are eight people wearing chain shirts and what appear to be uh, livery of House Growland. Um, right. as so well we... as, uh, two, um, people in leather, ar- black leather armor. Similar to the... We'll yep. say with the black, were they like the ones that I saw sneaking over or different? Slightly different. Okay. Um, but definitely probably with the same group. 
All right, so this is uh, that accounts for four out of the six people that snuck in here. Do we want to take our chances, or do we I mean, just kind of? There's two wanna... left that Zona we tr- know of. Zona silence is gone, so I'm a little more help. I look through this door as I'm talking. All right, uh, so you're gonna head and open it up. Uh. Yeah, I'm just going to peek through. Yeah, because there are no windows on the doors. That's just a... Oh, okay. All right, yeah, I, I peeked through this door. All right. Um, you see... A... What appears to be um, a bunch of scrub buckets, wash basins, some chamber pots. Uh, there are also two what appear to be servants' corpses um, on the stairs. Servant staircase in here. Actually, I, I go back in the other room and say that. I, I walk up to him. I'm not shouting that. <laughs> the silence is gone. I walk back over. The servant staircase in the next room over. And it looks like there's the main staircase here. Uh, well, what are we going to do about your friend here? Oh, uh, God. Uh, well, well, I could deal with it the same way I dealt with the other. Oh, uh, no. Uh-uh. You do happen to now have two perfectly good blunt instruments on the corpses of the two people you just defeated. Yeah, I'm gonna... Take one of the enemies and do it and seem like the enemy did it. All right. I mean, he did do um, it, but... I would like to point out the perfectly usable fire over there. Oh, that's good. Yeah, throw his face in the fire. Oh, somehow I hate that even more. <laughs> <laughs> It'll make less noise than you cracking his skull open. That's fair. All right. I, I grab the body. Oh, boy. Uh, nothing brings a party together like uh, <laughs> covering up a murder. <laughs> Drag the body over and just be like, ah, I, uh, Put it in the fire. Put, put, <laughs> Sorry, Corbin. Put it head first into the fire. <laughs> the smell of burnt hair and pork crackling slowly fills the room. Oh, God. Okay. Let's go to the servant stairs at least. Is that going to catch the This is odd, but this reminds me I didn't have lunch. <laughs> what? Oh, what? <laughs> nothing. Is that going to catch the rest of the place on fire? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> probably not, maybe. Uh... Well, I'll, I'll make sure the rest of the body is fully on the hearth there. There you go. Yeah, okay. Um, right. So, just so that you can continue to see, um, I'm going to go ahead and give you control of Truth's mini as well, Greg, so that way you maintain vision. Okay. That should at least still update your screen All as right. he moves we're around. Gonna, we're going to take the uh, server stairs here. Um, yep, so there is the corpse on the staircase, and there's a corpse in the room. Alright, well, I move the corpse off the staircase, then. Okay. I'm um, gonna shut the door behind us. <laughs> as as you do, it jingles a little bit. Oh, shit. Balls! Well. Upstairs! Alright, you, you first. Where, where are the stairs? Here. Oh, 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 sorry. I'm Very dark. Missouri, there. Are you able to go up the stairs? You may have to move to floor two and then go up some more. Uh oh. Hmm. That's a problem. Floor two, not there? There's no, a wall yeah, it in seems I never front finished, of the stairs. It seems I never finished uh, making the staircase. So oh. let me just teleport you guys up to where the top would be. Oh, uh, I appreciate <laughs> it. So go Works, to floor mate. three. Oh, boy. No, not Corbin. Truth. And... Um, so you guys, uh, you should be able to see your, uh, hallway? Yep. Okie dokie. Um, so yeah, you appear to be in what 
to what seems to be a servant's hallway. You can hear the sounds of fighting coming from through the wall to the um, west, which is this way. Let's go. Okay, lead the way. All right. Do, 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 do. <laughs> to the west? To yep. this door. Uh, give me just a second. Just looking up the description of that room. All right. Um, this seems to be a sparsely uh, furnished... Why is my camera not moving? Uh-oh. And my camera broke. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I can no longer move the camera. The well, things stopped loading, and I can't move the camera anymore. I can't. I also cannot view floor three. Oh. Uh, uh, so okay. give me a minute. I'm going to let me just switch. My, see if I can switch my player mode, and if that will fix things. It did, except floor three. Oh no. There we go. Fix it. All right. I'm still here. I'm good. Um. So. Um. Alpha. Uh, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, this seems to have a sparsely uh, furnished room with a standard straw bed, um, and and that's it. Small small end table. Is the fire not coming from over here? No, yeah, it is now coming from kind of behind you. Oh. Is there any way for us to get to that? Or? You do not see another door in this room. You can make one. <laughs> Maybe well, there's another staircase. Oh, full slow, guys. <laughs> no idea. What, that's just a bedroom. What? Ah, <laughs> oh, shit, this is the servant side. We should have gone up the other yeah, staircase. We should uh, head back downstairs and go up the main staircase. I think. Yeah, it's just servant's quarters. All right. All right. Okay. Run. Uh, take you guys back downstairs. We give me a moment. Kalana, Truth, and Martin. There you guys go. Should be back on the first floor. All right, yeah. who's leading the way? Do I see the bell on the door? Uh, there's not a bell on the door. It was the jingle oh, was from just... when he moved the corpse. Oh. Um, also, okay. um, just to let just to let you guys know, the whole reason that staircase didn't work is because extending the staircase up high enough would have screwed up the entire geometry of the house. Ah. Okay. <laughs> All, All right, right, to the other staircase. Yep. <laughs> Now, this staircase should work. So, the sounds of fighting grow louder as you come up the stairs. And as, uh, truth, as you crest the stairs, you see fighting going on pretty much right next to you. Roll initiative. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, eight. I mean, this is everyone, so give me a minute. Let me get my paper. My pepper, yeah. Are we on floor two or three? Uh, so the top is floor three. But if you're on the stairs, you're still technically on floor two. Um, oh, okay. In terms of, like, where you can control your character. Um, oh, okay. Give me a minute. I wasn't prepared for you guys to rush the stairs. And I have a lot of dice to roll, so I'm going to roll people in groups. Um, okay, so these guys act on initiative. Okay, these guys get... Alrighty, um, so 25 to 20. Okay, um, 20 to 15. I uh, got a 15, actually. Oh, okay. Um... Uh, can I just do it through here? I'm so surprised. Find your character. 
I'm so used to rolling low on initiative that for a moment I was like, wait a minute, numbers above six, six exist. <laughs> wait a minute, that's me! Um, all right, uh, 10 to, or yeah, 15 to 10, sorry. Okay. Oh, uh, 13, sorry. Can I click you? Yes. And then we I forgot my push to talk for a minute. <laughs> Uh, okay. Um, ten to five. Eight. <laughs> eh. Can't click mini. And. No, don't. Uh. All right. And that's everybody. Martin. Oh boy. So I guess I'm just gonna like slip past Kalana to get to the top of the stairs. And what do I see up here? You see three thugs, three black leather thugs fighting uh, what appear to be four guards of the house. Uh, they are the guards are kind of backed against a wall to a a, a door. All right. Well, I'm gonna pull out my crossbow and shoot one of the thugs in the back. You know, like an honorable combatant. That's going to be a hit. 18. All right. And... Oh, four damage. Oh. Uh, which thug is that specifically? Thug one? Okay. Uh, Kalana. I'm going to move a little upstairs so I can see what's going on. <laughs> if I can move the right way. Um, let's see. I'll take a shot at Thug 3. Okay. Twenty-seven. That's a natural twenty. So yeah. go ahead and roll. Uh, so roll two of the damage dice plus your normal modifier. Ten. Ten damage. Which thug was that? Three. Three. Okay. Nice hit. Thank you. Uh, now it's the thug's turns. So thug one is going to turn around. And attack truth. Uh, for 11 to hit. Sorry, 12. I always forget their modifier. Miss. Sorry. Okay. And a... Uh, 13 to hit. Also miss. Nice. Uh, Thug 3 is going to attack the guard he is fighting, which I need to get their stat block up. Yeah, I get to fight myself. He hits him. <laughs> or... uh, okay. Let me get these guys marked down. He is fighting. Which number is he fighting? Number one. Okay. And then he attacks him again. Which he actually has advantage. I forgot about that. Okay. For that much damage. Got it. Uh, 
All right. So now that's that was Thug Three. Now for Thug Two, who's going to attack his? But no, he's not. He's going to come over. He sees the newcomers, and he wants to take care of them. So he's going to come up and start fighting Martin. I like that I just have an empty room over here to roll dice in. Um, <laughs> so that is a 16 to hit. That hits. Uh, four damage. And then a... Ouch, ouch. 14 to hit. That does not hit. All right. I have the dice up. How do I get rid of it? There we go. Okay. Now the veterans will go. And they will start fighting. Okay. Let's see. They... I'm not going to roll their damage dice. I'm just going to roll their hits and use the average for damage. That's what I should do. Uh, that's a miss. And then... That is also a miss. Oof. Okay. Um, truth. All right. Uh, I'm going to look straight at the one who's been attacking me, and I'm going to point to the thugs still fighting the guards and cast uh, Eldritch Blast. <laughs> uh, if you do take do that at disadvantage. Because okay, he's within mind. five feet of you. Oh, okay. So, okay. Doesn't matter. Boop, boop, boop. Come on. Uh, 11. That's a hit. Oh, cool. Uh, sorry, it's been so long since I've been able to cast this. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's 6 damage. Alright. He's looking pretty hurt. Alright. Martin. Sorry, wrong oh, button. Oh, wait um, a second. What have I been doing? I even forgot to do this last time. What did oh. you forget? Oh, come on. Do I gotta be on the same floor? Uh, I'm scared. Sorry. Nope. You probably nope. Oh. Oh, oh. Uh, and as a bonus action, I'm gonna cast Hexblade's Curse on the guy in front of me who tried okay. to attack me. So there, now there should be some battle music going, at least. The light show is cool. All right. Yeah, sorry about that. I uh, I forgot which atmosphere was what. Well, it's okay. Yeah. It was it was Martin's natural environment to be in and <laughs> the crazy light. <laughs> All right. Uh, Martin, your go. I'm going to... Uh, insult the thug in front of me's parentage and also cast a uh, vicious mockery. Nice. So, one That's second. a saving throw, I think? Or is that an attack roll? Uh, it is save. Uh, wisdom save. DC 13. Eh. Keep forgetting my buttons. Um, wisdom save. Yeah. He fails. All right. Let's see, so that deal. Two damage, psychic damage, and they have disadvantage on the next attack roll. They... All right. Kalana. Let's go for hitting Thug 3 again. Seventeen. Seventeen, that's a hit. And five damage. All right. Uh, let me see how many health they were supposed to have when you got up here. Ba -ba. Double check in. Where the heck is this? There it is. All right, uh, he goes down. Yes. 
Bam. All right. Um, now it's the thugs' turns. Um, you can also hear what appears to be someone banging on a door in this room over here. Um, okay, so Thug 1 is going to attack Truth with advantage. Whoops. Uh, that is a 14 to hit. Uh, that misses. Okay, and then he'll attack again with advantage. For a 18 to hit. Uh, I can't, I use reaction to cast shield. Nice. Just toss that dice away. So it, it misses. Nice. All right. Uh, Thug 2 will attack Martin. Without advantage. Oh, wait. He has disadvantage. Or was that... Was that Thug 2? Mm hmm? Yeah, that was Thug 2 that you used that on. Uh, yeah, he failed. He, he missed. As, was it his next attack roll or until your turn? Who are you talking to? Mark. Oh. Sorry, I was hitting the wrong button for uh, push to talk again. Yeah, it was just his next attack roll. Okay, I'm going to ignore those two rolls. Because I had too many dice in my hand. Lucky you. Alright, let's see what that winds up being. That is an 8 to hit. Miss. Alright. So now the veterans get to go. And they are going to start moving in. To fight the thugs. Now that they are not blocked. Um, ba -ba -ba, okay. That's a hit on that thug. And that's a lot of damage on thug. One. Okay. These guys are actually... These veterans are pretty tough. And then he missed. Come in here. And miss. And... Miss. This guy is going to come over here and open this door where you now see that there is a, another uh, guy in black leathers, kind of fancier-looking uh, armor, trying to kick down a door. Um, which I need to get his stat block up. Oh. For some reason, it wasn't hotlinked on D&D Beyond, so I have to now scroll down and actually find it. Oh, the inconvenience. Very, very inconvenient. There he is. All right. Um, so he gets to go on initiative. Lots. <laughs> so, gonna go ahead and put him in the turn order now. Alright. Um, Veteran 3 is gonna kind of go up to him. And work on attacking him. And he's Actually, I think gonna hit him. Yes, he is. Dealing uh, seven damage. I really should use the HP trackers on the minis. It would be definitely be uh, more visibility for the streamer for the viewers on stream. But I kind of forgot to set them up. So whoops. <laughs> That's I mean, my bad. It... If you move your, if you hover your mouse over the stream, it pulls up our 
HP. I meant for the enemies. Ah, yeah, that'd probably be probably be good. Yes, I will make sure I do that next time. Um, and this guy's gonna come in and attack Thug One. Even the viewers are in the blind, just like us. Yep, pretty much. <laughs> On how much uh, HP there is. Instead, I just have a sheet of paper sitting here. All right, and that's a miss and a miss. Truth. Oh boy. Uh, I'm gonna attack the one in front of me with my great sword. Uh, and let's see. That's a plus five plus. Uh, just see what's it. Damage rolls. Uh, okay, what did I roll? Uh, so, 14. That's a hit. Cool. Which one are you attacking in? Uh, the one just directly in front of me. Number one. Got it. And that is... Six. Uh, that's 15 damage. Uh, he did. Ow. Yeah, I, I just come down like through his side of his neck and shoulder. What nice. And that gets me six uh, HP back because he had uh, the curse on him. Yeah. Oh, I feel so good. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, that Martin. was for Corbin. <laughs> All right. Um. Well, since it worked so well last time, I'm going to follow up by, uh, you know, making some... I don't know, I'm going to insult him again. I can't think of something clever. Uh, call him a butt. But yeah, wisdom saving. Okay. <laughs> You're a butt. Uh, he rolled a nine. All right. Three damage and he's disadvantaged on his next attack. All right. Uh, now it's this guy in the other room. Uh, he is going to take the disengage as a bonus action, and then one, two, three, four, uh, four, five, six, seven, and then he's going to start booking it out. He's just fucking running. Bitch. As soon as as soon as that door opened, basically, he was he was gonna he was gone. He is still downstairs though. Is I, he on the staircase? Yes, you he can fast. see him, Kalana. Oh hell yeah, we're shooting him. <laughs> Alright. It's your turn. Twelve. That's a miss. The arrow whizzes right by. Ah, damn it. Um. Can I? No, I attacked. I can't do anything. I mean, you can move. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna chase him down the stairs. Some. Okay. Um. Go ahead and move. Uh, just uh. You may have to transition to floor two, and maybe floor one. Give you some light there so you can see a bit better. I got it. Okay. I think you'd be able to catch up to him. All right. Uh, Thug's turn. As soon as I can click that next button. There we go. And he's going to attack Martin. He is getting tired of being called a butt. Um, 17 to hit. What is that was uh, with disadvantage? You're right, it was not. Gonna ignore that damage dice. Five to hit, or six to hit. Nope, that misses. Alright, well, with the second attack, he will roll a 21 to hit. Okay, yeah, what's gonna happen? For five bludgeon damage. And then the veterans are just gonna fucking womp this guy a new one. Um. Let's 
hit for that much. And then that's another hit. That much. And then veteran two is gonna also attack him. And yes, the veteran cuts him down. All right, um, veteran three is going to try to take chase, realize that you guys are helping, not hindering, and just kind of back up to the door instead, if he can get across all of his teammates. That'd be great. Nope, not that one. There we go. Okay, veteran four will also take post. Truth. Uh, I'm gonna back up to the top of the stairs here and kind of yell down. Hey, uh, you, you got things down there? Delana? Help would be appreciated. Alright, I run down the stairs. <laughs> you can see the fellow getting away. Oh, is he in line of sight? Yes. Ha, Eldridge Blast. <laughs> Hell yeah, 20. Yes. That's a hit. Uh, 11 damage. Damn. Alright. And then I back up and just like leave the way open just in case that the guys want to run down the stairs. Okay. Martin? I helped. You did. Um. Let's see, so the only guy is the one currently fleeing. Yep. Um. I'm just gonna wait, I guess. Okay. Are you gonna prepare an action? Um. No, I don't think so, because. Seems to me like combat's pretty much over. Um, seems to Martin like the danger has passed and I, he's not going to catch that guy, so. Okay. Our cloaked fellow is going to just fucking book it. Three, four. Open the door. Um, Kalana, were you in melee? No, you were, in, you were just one square away, weren't you, for your. So you could range. Yeah. Him. So. Yep. Oh no! I was I moved. I fired, and then I chased right next to him. Okay. Uh, then you get an, a melee attack of opportunity. Oh hell yeah! Uh, let's use um, my daggers. No, I got two daggers. Well, so. you only get one attack. Or one dagger. Sorry, one. All right, a dagger. Uh, fifteen. That's a hit. Two. Okay, you're definitely able to nick him. Um, you see a, a small gash in his armor as you swipe out with your dagger as he continues to run, but he does manage to run away. You, he, you see him dash out the door, and you've lost sight of him. If your, I run to the door. Your turn. Are you going to make chase? Yes. I'm going to try, I guess, at least for the yeah. moment. Yeah, I want to see if I can get at least get to the door and see if he's still up. Okay, go ahead and move to the door. If you can. You do not see him. Shit. Alright. Head back in. Head back up. Alright, and that is where we will end combat. Right, back to standard music. And Ooh. that is a good place to end the session. Uh, we can get into some RP yeah. um, right right off the gate. 
next round as you guys figure out what the heck is going on here in the Grauhund estate. Um, along with that nimble right, which you haven't tried to detect since you got back, since you actually got into the place. Been a little right. busy. Um, you, <laughs> <laughs> um, you all get to level four. Hey. In, including your new character, Woo. Greg, whoever that will be. <laughs> immediately, or is that on a long rest? Uh, that will be uh, immediately. Okay. Uh, but don't apply um, HP. Like, don't heal. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. I mean, you never know what you... I never know what you guys are going to do. <laughs> yeah, we could burn the air down. No, I'm kidding. Uh, At full health, we could take this guy. <laughs> you guys are all pretty right. good. Um, so we'll go ahead and I will drop the stream here in just a moment. Thank you all for coming and viewing. Hopefully the stream actually stayed up this time. It seems people were chatting it and did. I got some new followers. So I think everything actually worked for once. Yay. Um, this will be up on YouTube within uh, probably a few hours, honestly. Um, and I will post it around places. So thank you all for showing up. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.